one in three women and one in seven men have been victims of domestic violence. We're here at America's Beauty Show where the state of Illinois is training its first group of stylists in mandatory domestic abuse counseling. And for some of these stylists, the issue of domestic violence hits close to home. Salon professionals are a very nurturing group and they have this really unique amount of time that they spend with their clients. Oh yeah, perfect. And I think it was a unique opportunity to have a group of people that have this great relationship with their clients be more aware. As part of Chicago Says No More, we are providing them one hour of training on domestic violence and sexual assault and how they can um, provide resources to clients that they may find that encounter those issues. I've been cutting hair since I was 18. Um, I first cut my brother's hair when I was in eighth grade. My brother was five. Um, I knew from early on that I was going to use my salon and use my talents to help victims of domestic violence. My mother was in an abusive relationship and so as a, as a young child witnessing that, I know the long-term effects of what that can do to a family. And I knew um, that I wanted to help her and help women like her. Over 20 years ago I was abused. Then there's certain clients that you get attached to and she was one of them. She was my angel, come to my house and we moved my stuff out in the middle of the night. And we were not able to find any jurisdiction anywhere in the world that was trying this. Since we put it into effect, since the bill passed, we have been contacted and asked us for their advice on putting laws together and a regulatory framework together in their states. With the help of the city and organizations like Chicago Says No More, these beauty professionals are able to lead victims in the right direction. For more information or if you need help, visit chicagosaysnomore.org or thehotline.org.